Hello, I'm a physician, a psychiatrist here, and I've been using self to code um, as, as often as an easier and a less expensive option for um, being able to obtain actual kind of like um, genetic raw data for patients, as well as then getting access to a lot of the, the self to code reports, which is able to give me a robust information, able to get based upon the patient's needs, look at different reports, um, be able to get them downloaded, uploaded in the portal so that they're able to have them, and be able to take a really a deeper dive into areas that we might want to go towards supplementation or whatnot. Um, the reports have been really well organized, a lot of information, so I do have to take some time with patients to show them how to look through it. But I think the most important parts is that you have a clickable table of contents. We can jump right to the recommendations, ordered in, in areas of priority. Sometimes it's just helpful to be able to have something that is um, uh, more in some ways kind of proscriptive, like, hey, this is where we can begin and then dive up further and say, hey, this is why we want to start with these. I also like in here that we're able to get access to the raw data so that as more things um, come out, the more we learn, the more other places where I can analyze data, I'm able to take that raw data and run it through that for both myself and, and for, for clients. Um, and as I say, overall, th things have been going well with it. Patients have enjoyed the information. It's a lot of information, and a lot of it's just trying to find, okay, hey, what are we going to prioritize? Where are we going to begin? And I like that they have it laid out in, and the ability to use the, the click-through option in the PDF to jump right to those recommendations as opposed to having to scroll through everything else. Thank you.